very day. Make yourself independent. Look for something doing. Go out of your way. If really you want to bring respect for yourself in your marriage. And let me tell you something. Allowing a man to sleep with you is not an antidote or an antibiotic to heal a wounded soul. Yes, you are already wounded in that relationship. It's all over you. It's engulfed in you. We are seeing it from our screens. But you coming to social media to say, you people ask me to sleep with my husband and I have given in to it. Even makes you more foolery of yourself. Yes, because I have come to realize that Lemon doesn't love you anymore. Okay? If Lemon loved you, that was once upon a time. He only liked to be with you. He only liked to be around you. He only want to sleep with you whenever he feel horny. Because obviously you can see that Joy Satanic have taken over his life when it comes to love affair matters. That is what I'm seeing from my own angle. Okay? So... If you really want to get Lord of Lemon's love back as you started hmm, with him, I have told you what to do. Don't depend on him. Don't be begging him anymore. You don't try. And moreover, I will say this eh, without any fear or favor. You rushed into marriage too early. You are too young. By now, I believe you are in your early 20s, right? You're supposed to be enjoying your youthful age. Not be married is supposed to be your priority, Mary Lane. Yes. Because even people who are of age, who are due for marriage, that are now into marriage, you know the easy with them. The lot of husbands that they see there, the headache and pains. If you are not strong enough with both flesh, all right, you cannot sustain a marriage. That is why you see marriages broke up in little or no time, few months into marriage, people don't pack out because they cannot take it. Marriage is like a parcel. Until you unveil it, you will not know what is inside. So you going into marriage because you don't want to be like a loose woman who sleep around from one bed to another. I think it's not so because it still depends. We have one million and one girls out there who are single but they are not public toilets. They are not Puerto Republic. They are not dogs. They respect themselves, keep themselves until they are ready for marriage. Thank you, my audience. And thank you once again for your support and love towards this channel. Guys, please help me to share out this video. Follow if you have not. Just a quick reminder that the release Big Mommy, who advised lemon to take another wife should be the one that people should be pointing accusing fingers on and not joy because she caused the problem for her daughter no hating, no She sing this music. She say, make you not do something when it will practically affect you. Mary Lynn. Mary Lynn, do you know why I always talk about you? You know the year word. And then say, fly when not the year word. Now they follow dead body, they enter inside grave. Because person don't buy already. The fly want to know what in the inside the grave. Now make you see full and go beneath his feet. Mary Lynn, your Marenta crisis that happened sometime in March 2023 was because you went and pranked your husband with one of his best mates called Tiny Berry. Till today, being March 
2024, we are still begging Lord of Lemon to take you back as wife. Make on two they do on a jurification as the day before. But Matrix action jamboree one na they do we we say that was the reason you went to ask Lemon's hands for Ben Matrix relationship because you find that he's worthy in your sight. All right, you took that bold step. It's supposed to be vice versa. It's a man that's supposed to leave the parents and cleave to a wife, but now you took the bold step to ask Lord of Lemon for relationship. Thank God they did not turn you down. Along the line, he fell in love with you. Two of them come, run things for four good years, and he decided to marry you. But why I talk say you know they hear something after what ha- transpired between you and Tiny Berry, you still went and prank your husband again with untouchable comedies. Hmm. Flower boy brother because I don't know the relationship between the two of them. You get mind, invite untouchable comedies to your matrimonial home to tell him to tell Lemon that he wants to marry you. Amongst all the fine fine babes when untouchable don't follow do comedy rich. You don't see anyone when you go enter you eye. Now Mary Lynn, where we say her leg still be one leg in, one leg out of Lemon. If they ever live lemon life, pata pata. Now untouchable with Marilyn still go prank. Say now come being baby oku when you want to marry as on as a lemon is maltreating Marilyn, is not respecting her. So therefore, is the man that can handle Marilyn very well. So is ready to marry Marilyn. When Lord of Lemon provoke, now no say it's a big shout now. Nah. Nah, hey. When the vexation come out of him, when he wanted to fight or touch him, that was when the contacts in her prank. Mary Lynn, I don't just understand the kind of content where you would like to do to the offend your man. Lemon is in love with you. He's a jealous lover. It's obvious. Because with a Siam, when I still talk, say, you carry Bele for Lemon. At the end of the day, let come out, we don't know what thing happen. But my question is that must you always upset your husband? I don't like when somebody go to the person and say, I don't like this thing where they do me, if they make me the verse. You go still the dwarm. Eh? You did prank number one, you don't scatter your marriage. You brought prank number two with untouchable. Lemon say you should leave his house that day. You did another one now with unwise one. Two of them are day for house. You slept in his house and you said nothing happened. Though. Okay, we agree. Mary Lynn, what is your problem? What is the color of your wahala? Why is it that you are not mature? Eh? You just jump into marriage. You don't go marriage canceling. I'm not even sure. You are not groomed to know how to handle marriage, Mary Lynn. Eh? Now, wow. And for you and Joy that are always insulting yourself with pregnancy, they don't they use Bele the laugh person? I don't know who started insulting with uh, the miscarriage, but I heard from Mary Lynn when she was making mockery of Joy. Eh? And at the end of the day, Joy won't begin to fall out, come out. Eh? Now, what for now? There is life and death in the tongue, make one the guide in her ways. All right? So that is my own take on this one. Stop all this prank where you did do your man. If you really want to settle down. After all, it was your big mommy that told the Lord of Lemon to go and bring another woman into the house. Say your eye day up, you're not ready for marriage. Which Lord of Lemon don't do? You still the vest. Who are you supposed to hold? Is it not your big mommy? Were you not there when she said, Lemon, bring another woman and I go clear? Or be you not the time you say she not mean her? Yes, this is where the tongue comes in. As the Bible says, there is power in the tongue. So make with the watch with him with the talk. Guys, please keep following this page for more great gist and news. And thanks once again for always tuning in. Goodbye for now.